Hello and welcome to CB Tech Tips. In this video, we're going to show you how to set up your iPad for the first day at school. I'm guessing by this point you would have already received the documentation which highlights some of the reasons we use an MDM profile and what, it, what we don't use it for. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact the school. There's an email address on the piece of paper. So, step one, make sure your iPad has access to the internet. For this uh, setup process, your iPad will need access to the internet and it will need to be on the latest version of iOS. So if you go down to settings and you check you've got an internet connection and now it says no internet connection, but that's okay. And we go into software update, it will check for an update and if there's an update here, you'll need to um, install this first. You'll need above 50% to install an update. If your device has been used at a primary school or by another person, please reset the iPad so it's set up with you, with your Apple ID. All right, step two. Along with this paperwork would have come a username and password that was sent to you, it's, which is the first letter of your first name followed by your surname. So for me, Reese Lawrenson, it's R. Lawrenson. And the password will be your initials followed by your six digit student ID, which is provided in the paperwork. So for me, it's RL160001. This, uh, when you're at school, you'll be expected to know your username and password to log into the other suites. Put it down in your notes app to make it easier to find. Now the next step we want to do is open up the camera app on our iPad and scan the QR code in step three. This will then open up a web page, which if we give it a second here, and then you're going to want to enter in your username and password. So for me, again, R. Lawrence, and, and then my password, which has been provided to me and push go and then you want to hit accept and continue. This will then download a profile and you want to push allow and profile has been downloaded. From here we want to go back into our settings app and on the top left it will say profile downloaded. If you don't get this it might be hidden in continue setting up iPad. If you still can't find it I'll show you go back to general on the left Scroll down to device management and you'll see there it says download a profile. We can tap on that. If you don't get this far, try and download the profile again and start the process again. Again, if you have any issues, feel free to contact the school. We then hit install, enter our password in. It'll ask us to install, install. And this process can take a few minutes sometimes, especially when doing it from home. And we'll want to hit install again, trust, It'll enroll the certificate. And that's it. Done. Simple as that. So if we go back into Safari, it will say the enrollment process is complete. Now, we're not completely done. If we go home, we'll now see two new um, web clips appear in a second, which is the learn link um, for your emails and our school intranet, which has useful links on it. But within the next five to 10 minutes, you should get a prompt on your screen that will come up here on my screen in a second for you to see that says app installation, do you want to install the self-service app? This, this self-service app is like our own app store. You don't need an Apple ID and we put some paid apps on there that you might need at school. You can also download Word, PowerPoint and so on. However, if you're at home, it's easier to use the app store and a lot quicker to use the app store. Um, but please use self-service if you're at school. So now we'll give it a bit of time and I'll skip ahead to when my iPad is ready. Like I said, this process can take five to 10 minutes sometimes, and especially when everyone's doing it from home, it could take a little longer. Don't, don't stress if you don't get this process. When you get to school, let us know in, our, in your designated iPad session, and we can force the app down to you and you'll get the prompt straight away. So let's give it a bit of time. So mine took about two and a half minutes and as we can see we've got the department for which is supposed to say Department of Education which is our Learn Link um, shortcut and our CV intranet shortcut and we have the prompt on screen that says do you want to install self-service don't push cancel push install if you do happen to push cancel let us know on again on the first day in your iPad session and it'll bring up this and we're going to want to hit install So as we can see here, we've, the app is ready for an update. So we'll click update. And it should take us out of the app. 
and start updating from the App Store. And if it doesn't, we can click continue and there's all our apps we provide here at the school. So you can download the Office apps, Stop Motion Studio, Clips and Dame app as well. But don't worry about setting them up just yet. We'll show you how to do that on the first day. So thank you for watching. That's how you set up your iPad for use at Seaview. Um, but on the first day, if you run into any problems, again, don't hesitate to contact the school or you can wait till the first day. IT will be around to assist setting up the iPads. Thank you.